It's a chilling confession. A young father describing murdering his baby. What sent him over the edge? News 13's Alex Tomlin has his confession tape. Alex? Jessica, Christopher Raines tells detectives he was pushed to his limits the afternoon he put a bullet in the back of his 10-month-old daughter's head. A warning, parts of his confession are disturbing. Christopher Raines sits in this white jumpsuit because they've taken his clothes as evidence. It's just hours after he shot his baby girl, Trinity. Today, I got pushed over the edge. Raines says his girlfriend wanted to leave him for another man. And I didn't want him to become her new daddy. For days leading up to the December 2009 shooting, the two have been fighting over her affection for this new guy. And that afternoon was no different. To scare Ashley, I picked up Trinity. And then I cocked my gun while carrying the baby. He says after a few minutes, he calmed down and put Trinity on the floor in a play area. That's when his girlfriend confessed she's seen her new flame naked. Rain says he lost it. Chris left the building right there. He cocks the gun and points it at the back of the baby's head as she plays on the floor. He says he demanded to know how she saw him naked. And she was all, okay, fine. It was during a card game. And that's when I was all, boom, and actually screamed. Loud. I said, was it worth it, Ashley? Was it worth it? He tells detectives it took several minutes for reality to sink in. After calling 911, I just killed my daughter. He thinks about himself. I'm going away. I'm a small guy, so I'm not going to make it in there. That was all I was thinking. He went into another room to shoot himself, but. I was thinking about how much it's going to hurt for that second, and that was the only reason that was stopping me. Rain's fears about being a small guy in jail came true during his first appearance. While waiting to go in front of the judge, another inmate jumped him. His case is still pending. Jessica? Okay, Alex, Christopher Rains was supposed to plead guilty last August to the murder in front of Judge Pat Murdoch. As we told you Monday, several cases have been delayed since Murdoch left the bench after being accused of raping a prostitute. Rains' case has been reassigned to a new judge who is getting up to speed.